welcome back to my channel i hope you all are doing very well if you are new here hi my name is michelle bb and i welcome you to my channel and i really hope you enjoy my content and if you do please hit the subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you can be notified as soon as i upload new content for my returning subscribers welcome back as always so guys today we are on day eight of vlogmas and I decided to do something fun for today, which is going to be a Never Have I Ever Christmas edition. So I'm really excited to do it. I wish there was someone here with me to do it, but yeah, there isn't just me. Um, but that's still fine. I think it's still going to be fine. And yeah, in this way, you'll get to get to know me a little bit better as well. So um, I got one from... A one from Google that I'm going to read from my phone and then I will answer all them as accurate as I can. So guys, let's get into this Never Have I Ever Christmas edition. Okay guys, so the first one is Never Have I Ever Had Eggnog. I have. So actually last year with Vlogmas, um, it was the first time that I had eggnog. I made it from scratch when we were at my parents' house for the day for Christmas um, and we all had it for the first time and we actually really liked it. Well, I did. So, yes, I have had it. The second one is, never have I ever worn an ugly Christmas sweater. I never have. I really want to do that. Like, I really want to do that. I think it will be fun. So actually last year with my vlogmas, I created um, ugly, well not ugly, it was cute. I created shirts for me and hubby that I did myself. I DIY'd it uh, with Christmas trees on it and Merry Christmas on it. And I must say it was so fun to wear it on Christmas Day. Um, and yeah, we really loved it. So, And we still have them. I will show you um, a clip of how it looks. Thing number three is never have I ever built a gingerbread house. Also, actually, not that I can remember, so I uh, know I never had. This is also something I really want to do. Um, I see a lot of people have get those like a, a box that have everything in it, like then you can build your um, gingerbread house. I really actually wanted to go and look for it, so I still have to do that and see if I can get one somewhere to actually do it. Otherwise, I will have to try to bake the gingerbread myself. But yeah, we will see about that. Never have I ever made a snow angel. Um, if I remember correctly, I did with my sister. We were still in school. It was, I think it was in 2009. That was when it was snowing in South Africa. Um, yeah yeah it was 2009 um so it was it was in the, during the night it started to snow and we went outside because it was our first time seeing snow so if i remember correctly yes me and my sister laid on the on the floor and we made snow angels so yes i definitely have <laughs> um Never have I ever taken a picture with Santa. Yes, I did when I was little. Like I was still in preschool. Um, they had like a Chris, a Father Christmas, and yes, I did sit in Santa, Santa's lap. I can't remember all the details, but I know somewhere my mom has a photo of me um, sitting on um, Santa's lap. I will just yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was still very little. <laughs> Never have I ever worn Xmas pajamas. I think when I was little, my mom always bought us like this cute pajamas. Um, so yeah, if I remember correctly, I did. Um, but when I was bigger, no, I didn't really. I still want to get into doing that because I always see those videos of couples where, or families even wearing the same pajamas as like a set and it actually looks really cool so me and Abby need to work on that <laughs> okay 
never have I ever been skiing. No, I never have been. I never have. Um, that's also something I would really love to do. Um, I always see that in Christmas movies and it looks so much fun and like a really great um, journey to go on. Um, I think, yeah, the skiing trip is something definitely on my bucket list. So, yeah. <laughs> Uh, sorry guys, I just wanted to take a sip of my coffee. Okay. Never have I ever cut down a real x mystery. Never have. I never have. This is something that I also really wish we could do here in South Africa. Um, is to actually have real Christmas trees. Um, to in each year go and cut off your own Christmas tree and set it up in your house. But we are still on the fake Christmas tree trend. So yeah, never, I have never cut down a real Christmas tree. Never have I ever re-gifted a, a Xmas present. No, I never have done that. <laughs> That's just, I don't know if I would feel right to do that. I know there's people who actually does that. It's not a bad thing, but I just never felt like doing that. Um, so yeah, um, never have I ever kissed under the mistletoe, I have, me and Harvey actually, I think it was two years ago, um, we went to this park, we were still staying in Springs, um, we went to this park that they made up with Christmas lights, it was so beautiful, I will look for the clip and I will actually put it in here, it was really so beautiful, um, we didn't know about the park and when we saw it, we immediately stopped the car and we got out and they had this tunnel and everything like that and somewhere there was also a mistletoe and yes, we did kiss. I don't remember if I actually took a, a video or a photo of that, but yeah, we definitely did kiss under the mistletoe. <laughs> Never have I ever picked at my gift before Christmas. Well, I have. <laughs> um, I believe everyone has done this. Like, especially when you're a kid, like, you get so excited about getting gifts, you want to peek and see what you get. Um, so yeah, I definitely have when I was little. Never have I sat on Santa's lap. I think when I took the picture with with Santa when I was little, I did sat on his lap. But yeah, that's what I think. That's how I remember it, kind of. Like I said, I was very little. Um, never have I ever gone caroling. I have. Um, when I was in school, um, we actually, uh, the group of prefects, um, we went um, to an old age home and we went, we walked through there and went to all the rooms and um, actually sang in some carols and it was so much fun but it was so sad to see all of those old people being so alone and some of them were really sick um, and all of that but they enjoyed just that little bit of getting attention and getting the love from the few of us who were there so yeah I did bring caroling I think we should we as people should do that more often. I know um, in other countries that's like a, a, a big um, tradition, but I don't think in South Africa there's really a lot of that happening. Like, no, I don't think so. But that would be actually really fun if we could do that. But I don't think with crime and everything going on here, I don't think that would be a great idea, but I think it would be awesome. But yeah, <laughs> we'll see. Maybe one day. Never have I ever had a white Christmas. No. And this is something I wish I could have done. I wish I had. Like this is a wish that I've had like forever. Like I joke around and I tell Harvey, listen, let's, let's um, save up some ma money so that we can go to a country where it's always a white Christmas because ugh, I just I would love that like we, we are here in South Africa we have a summer Christmas so it's hot and um, it's not snowy and yeah I like the summer but 
I would really love a white Christmas one day just because it's so beautiful with the white and the snow falling and all the green trees and all the Christmas lights and everything like that. So yeah, I would I would love a white Christmas. So maybe one day me and Hubby can go somewhere and we can have a white Christmas. I think that would be like the best. Like the last one is never have I ever roasted chestnut on an open fire. Never. I've never done that. So so guys, I just felt like doing something fun for today's video and I really actually hope you did enjoy. Um, I really enjoyed doing this because it actually, it takes you back and you, it lets you think of things you did in your life and I think it's actually fun. Um, we sometimes like, you did so many things when you were little and you don't always remember all those things and when you sit down and you actually think about it and the memories come back, it's just so beautiful, like, yeah. I remember when, like, when me and my sister, we, we saw the snow for the first time. It was just such a great experience. Um, I remember I took my mom and my, my mom and my sister still had to go out for the day. It was in the school holidays. And I think my sister started working during the school holidays. So she and my mom left to go to work. And me and my dad were at home. And I was, it was school holiday, like I said, so I was obviously off and I was at home. So I actually went back to bed and waited till the morning. And then when I woke up, I was excited. I'm going to play in the snow. And I actually um, took a bucket and I filled it up with snow and I put it in the fridge. And my dad was like, what are you doing? And I said, I want to save the snow because yeah this is really special and i want to say that um and to think i was already in high school at that time and that was the excitement i had like seeing the snow for the first time was like this wild thing so um yeah and then eventually my dad said listen we have to take the snow out of the fridge out of this river because it's taking so much space and there's no use for it. Um, so I think we should throw it out. And I was a bit sad at that moment, but it was really, really fun. And also I tried, because it didn't snow a lot. It was just like a quick snow and it was over. So I actually also tried to get enough snow together to try and build a snowman, but I wasn't so lucky. I couldn't really build a nice enough snowman, but I did try. So. It's things like this that when playing these types of games that you just think about things you have done in your life. And I think it's actually fun. We should do that more often because you forget about that great memories, especially in the the times when things are so difficult and, and all of that. We just think of all the serious stuff and we don't think about all the great memories and all the things we did in our lives. So, so yeah, guys, if you... If you want to, you can answer these questions in the comments and let's see what all of us have done or not have um, or never did. I think that's so much fun and, and all of that. So I hope you enjoyed this little game of Never Have I Ever Christmas edition. I really enjoyed it. Um, let me know what your answers are or some of these in the comments below and let's chat about it and see what all of us have done and never done um so guys um don't forget to like comment and share and please hit the subscribe button guys it's free to subscribe and guys remember to have fun and enjoy this christmas season create memories spend time with family and just don't ever forget to love yourself and to love your loved ones so guys this is it Bye guys.